sort of like this lockdown and quarantine has put emphasis on the fact that we need to see the big fights happen now. We've, we've seen guys like Tyson, uh, Tyson Fury and Anthony Joshua being talked about and while they're taking step aside money and all this sort of stuff, just so we can see the big fights happening. Your opinion on this? Do you think Wilder should take that step aside money and let us have Joshua, Joshua Fury? Or Fury Joshua, however you want to look at it? Um, contracts are contracts. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I mean, I've known fighters take step aside money. Uh, it'd be great if it, if it does. If it does happen. But it's how much he'd want stepping aside money. You know, it's a, I'm pretty sure the fight, the first fight they had, they generated um, so much money. They got a big, they got a big purse. Um, I don't think I think Fury will do the same to get me Wilder. I, I think that's that that's a fight gone now. So everybody wants to see Fury and Joshua. But my question is, is, is when Dylan when is Dylan White gonna get his chance? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. He's, you know, he, he's out there. He's fighting everybody. They keep putting this money in front of him. He's beating him, he's ch and he, he's getting no close to his chance. I just dope he gets a chance to. Everybody wants to see Wilder and Fiora, um, Fiora and Joshua. But I'd like to see Dillian White get his chance as well. In saying that then, do you think, let's talk about Fury versus Wilder, uh, Fury versus Joshua in December in Saudi Arabia. If Wilder takes step aside money, that means Wilder will probably get the win of the WBC belt, WBC belt which pushes Dillian even further down the line. But do you think yeah. Dylan should get the win of Joshua Fury before Wilder? Would you like to see that? Might be a dumb question. Yeah, I'd like to see, yeah, of course, because I want him to get his chance. Definitely want him to get his chance. I think I think he deserved it, but you've got to be realistic here. It, it's 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 not going to happen with if you know if you're in contract, you're in contract. Mm -hmm. um, and I know the kind of ways around it, like like you said, step aside, one eh? but. Um, but yeah, I don't like. Like I said, I I, I don't think Wilder beats Fury. I think that uh, you know we. I think that fight is over with now. Um, but you know, it, it, might have, it? it might have to happen before Joshua and Fury does. I don't know. But boxing's a we weird, weird old game, isn't it? Definitely. Weird old game. We've been in the game long enough to know that, Martin. <laughs> so yeah. so I'm gonna, <laughs> I'll, I'll put you on the spot then, Joshua Fury. Who's, who are you picking? Yeah. Sure, yeah. Yeah. I've kind of, I've, all, I've, I've thought it over the past couple of years, obviously, you know, you get asked a lot about it and I've always kind of thought it'd be a close fight, but um, I'm not saying that it won't be close, but I just think Fury's the, the on-form uh, on fighter and what he did to Wilder in his last fight, I didn't, I didn't, didn't expect that. I think he's improving all the time. He's massively confident and I think Fury's a man to beat now everywhere. What about, what about Wilder versus White then? If that fight, if we do get Joshua Fury, would you like to see Wilder versus? And it might not be for the WBC belt that that White's been asking for, but it's a fight that he wanted. It might not be no belt I'm on the a, line. I'm, I'm a big Dylan White fan. Um, yeah, I am. I, I, I respect him for everything that he's doing, everything that he's he, he's gone through, he's going through. Um, if Wilder and Dylan White fought, I'd, I'd Dylan White all day. I'm telling you, um, yeah, I, I, I just hope he gets his chance. Hope he gets his chance. I think if he fought Joshua again, I think he'd beat Joshua. Dylan White, I think he's improved massively. I think, obviously, everybody wants to see Fury and and, um, and Joshua, but um, I, I, I think Dylan White and Fury is a, a better fight. The heavyweights are dominating boxing right now. I mean, like, Old heavyweights as well, Mike Tyson. He's been, he's been yeah, he's smashed. Back, he's, he's back. He's back, baby. I mean, yeah. what's your thoughts on that, Mo? I mean, you're, you're, you're saying that you're quite happy. If you were to retire now, you'd be quite happy to retire and you've got a lovely family and whatnot. Do you ever think in the back of your mind you'll have those, those itchy knuckles like Mike Tyson and be 55 and be like, I want to not, come back? Not, not that age. You know, they said the last thing you lose is your power. Tyson has got that in abundance on it. You know, you still see him on little stuff he's doing. You still see that he's kind of, you know, he's a natural, he's got the moves, but, mate, you're fighting these young, young guns, and, you know, I, I, it's all right, 
me now, I, I'm what pro, 38 in a couple of months, and I'm kind of like ready for retirement. Um, but I can, you know, I'm I'm still there with it. How old's Tyson? 55. Yeah, 53. Sure. I think 53. 53. Sorry, 53. Yeah. I'm not saying that he can't come and I'm not saying that he can't come back and you know um, chin a few people, um, but I just think he's a little bit too old, especially fighting somebody like you know them them top heavyweights right now at the minute. Like, you know what I mean, but they... who knows, you know, but but like I said, boxing's a funny old game. Who knows what can happen? And you know what? If he if he thinks he can do it, and he wants to do it. Good luck to him. It's a bit well. There's that exhibition fight being talked about with Evander Holyfield because Evander Holyfield came out and said that he's he's coming back and he's willing yeah. to do a four round exhibition with Mike Tyson. Now, as a boxing fan, Martin, don't lie to me. You want to see that, don't you? No, no, that'd be amazing. <laughs> yeah, without without a shadow of a doubt, it would, and it'd be good to see what they've got left. Do you know what I mean? It would it would be brilliant to see. But I just think um, an exhibition. And I'm, I'm guessing it'll be with big gloves on and a real fight um, with with small ten ounces on and you know a, a lot more on offer. I just think it's different, mate. I just mm -hmm. think it's completely different. But who knows what will happen?